Surgeons at UC Health are the first in the region to successfully perform a robotic living donor liver transplant. Part of a woman's liver was removed robotically, then transplanted to a baby. Surgeons say the surgery is more invasive when done by hand, but doing it with a robot allows them to make smaller incisions, more easy to hide. A surgeon at UC Health who was part of the procedure says this operation also makes recovery easier for the patients and also hopes it might make people less wary of becoming donors. Removing the disincentive to donation, I think, is the big goal here. Um, you know, if you have to take several weeks off work in order to be a donor, that's that can be a tough thing for a lot of people. But if we can really truncate that and make it smaller and make it more manageable for for people to consider, then hopefully, you know, our, we can we can transplant more people and, and, and get these cases done. Well, if the idea of an easy recovery from transplant surgery sounds too good to be true, you could take it from the donor herself. The woman who donated part of her liver for the transplant told us she's feeling 110 percent. I came home and I worked, I walked a mile the next morning after I, I got home. Um, the second day I walked another mile. So that was my goal every day. Like, okay. And it, it went slow, but I was able to do it. Um, fortunately, I didn't experience like hardly any fatigue. There were a few naps here and there, but I felt like it was an amazing recovery experience. And an amazing experience in other ways. Kuhlman says being part of it means the world to her. She says it'll be the legend that she leaves behind. She's been in contact with that baby's family since the surgery and hopes to meet them soon.